Welcome back guys, I'm Microhamster here, and today I'm doing a quick tutorial on RPG Maker MV. Now this is the game I'm working on, and uh, I just wanted to show you guys quickly uh, how to do something along the lines of a grappling hook. Um, as you can see right here, uh, our character goes in this dungeon area and needs to get across these areas. Well, I devised some sort of grappling hook roundabout system, so let's, uh, let's give it a, a quick test. Big size. Right. So basically, talk to this guy. He gives you your grappling hook. Uh, oh, oh, my bad. Key items. So now you have a grappling hook. And then we need to open up an area. So now, to get across, simply just uh, use the grappling hook. That's basically it. It's uh, get you across. There's no fancy animations and you know like a grappling hook shooting out. It's more or less you see it hit the wood and you fly across. So I'm gonna quickly show you guys how I did this. So basically, you just want to make uh, an event right here. Uh, you want to go and make a if then parameter. So that would be a conditional branch. Set it to item, uh, select your grappling hook, so you'd go and make a, an item called grappling hook as a key item. And then, uh, you know, uh, you add your little text, say you want to use your grappling hook, and uh, give a yes or no. So, after it says yes, um, I put a, an effect, a piercing effect, uh, onto the top of uh, my hook 001, I named it hook 001 so that it'll make a little effect that the grappling hook attached to it and then what you're going to want to do is uh, create a uh, movement for your player so you want through on so that your character can walk through the unwalkable dark abyss you want to turn his walking animation off so that it doesn't look like he's walking it looks like he's being dragged uh, I changed the speed to six so it's kind of quick I set a, a quick wind effect like the whoosh as him going across the side and then moving in whatever direction you need him to go. So I, he goes four spaces to the left. I change the speed back to normal. I turn the walking animations back on. And then I make him not walk throughable. Like, uh, yeah. And then, uh, yeah. But then you just have the end of the, the branches. You know, leave it the way it is. And then, bam. Uh, you can set this up in multiple uh, areas. Also, make sure when you're <clears throat> setting this down, you make it as same as the character. So that it's not underneath them. So when he goes to the edge, he can go across. And then I did the same for the other side. Now this way this works, he can only go across once. He can't come back the other way. So to set it up the other way, you would have to um, basically just do reverse. Um, you know, but he has nothing to latch onto over here. So you know, you gotta kind of make it a puzzle thing to where he can only go one way, not the other. So yeah, that's uh my generic grappling hook and how it worked. If you guys have any questions, leave it down in the comments or send me a message. I'd be more than happy to help and uh, see you guys in the next one.